Hi, this video is the Art of Hair Transplant Restoration Surgery result one year post-op with before and after photo by Dr. D. And this is the result of the FUE. Uh, this client had 3,053 graft. And um, it's only 10 months now. He reported to me that in three months or four months, he actually had a full set of hair. Um, he actually had a procedure done before that too, before I, prior to my work. And uh, the surgeon was a non-FUE specialist, so he bought, he bought some device and some instrument to, to harvest the hair graft and so the surgeon didn't really touch about pulling the hair graft. Um, and because of that, uh, being a non-FUE specialist, the uh, graft tend to not be healthy and then thus you have poor density because it doesn't matter the best technician to put the hair graft in but if you have horrible roots, it's, you're not going to have good density at all to tell you the truth. Uh, with my work, I'm the one who manually harvesting the hair graft uh, one at a time. Now, the surgery is around 12 to 16 hours, but the FUE to harvest the hair graft manually one at a time is around 6 to 8 hours being done by me. Um, and of course, another 2 hours to make the site and all the stuff. Um, this client actually a uh, physician himself and uh, was kind enough to allow me to uh, show the audience uh, uh, what his result looked like. He actually... Um, Again, uh, his result was not just poor density, but uh, there's no artistry. They didn't bring his temple as well. He actually mentioned to me that he went to other uh, doctor in the clinic and they wouldn't want to do the temple, uh, but, but because the temple is really difficult to work with. And it took many years for me to master the temple. Um, but if we don't work on his temple, and again, I'm a very OCD and obsessive compulsive about how natural the hairline is, if we don't bring the temple, you, you have a low hairline but a wide forehead. That doesn't look natural. You want to be proportional vertically and horizontally as well. And of course, he has a full density right now. Um, but I'm going to show the audience what he looked like before. You see, that's with the, the result of a uh, past surgery. Again, the doctor did not manually harvest the hair graft. He used some kind of device to do that and with poor density and have tiny mini graph. It's hard to see in the photo, but it's there. Now look at that a year with my work and I'm the one who manually harvests the hair graph. I'm not only to look, there's poor density and that, but I, I, look, I brought in his temple and again to show the audience that was poor density on top. And so we see we brought in the temple and look the hairline. Now we have full density. Again, poor density on top and we gotta bring his temple because it was poor. And again, you see that's poor density on top. And one year with my work, and actually 10 months, we're running his temple and lower hairline with full density. And the temple is not designed for density. The temple designed to frame your face better. Uh, and with a f nice framing and f uh, proportional horizontally and vertically, you're going to have excellent result. So that's a year later. And there he is. Okay. And can you turn perfect this side? Can you turn to the other side for me? Perfect. Go ahead. Turn all the way back for me. Um, so just show the audience that you know uh, you can't really see. Um, this is the donor area, and you don't see no um, scarring at all. And so now I'm gonna turn all the way around <laughs> for the audience to uh, to show the audience. I almost forget about the donor again. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so if you can turn this way a little bit more, there we go. Perfect. And you can tilt your head this way. It's perfect for the eye to see. Uh, look at that. This is a full set of hair. And uh, again, he wanted to mention to me to tell the audience that um, he did not use topic or any trick to increase the density. This is all his natural hair. And I'm going to comb it through for the audience to see. Um, this is all his real hair, and you can see very nice natural. And I give him a, what I call a, a medium tight hairline, so to maximize the density, um, and without drawing much attention to his hairline, and we're brought his temple again. With a full set of hair and low set of hairline, it really enhances the eyes, the nose, and all the features that God created. Um, uh, this physician himself, a GI specialist. Uh, was kind enough to uh, sh allow me to show the audience. Again, he was the audience himself before, and he mentioned that he saw a lot of my video, a lot of my work. Um, actually, he had to do a little bit more research after he had a bad past experience. 
and when he stumbled my work he was ha impressed again with, with the density and how natural it is but he was skeptical at the beginning because he was saying oh, it, it looks too dense to be true uh, now again thank you doc uh, uh, that <laughs> but you will be believer and being a believer you he actually uh, you know want to show the audience that it's real that's his no gimmick and is being manually done by me and he and um, the result is natural and it's very dense it completely transform his look again with a full set of hair and a full and a lower hairline with not just the whole hairline and the temple is being brought in it really enhanced the eyes the nose and all the features that God created for him he not only looked more handsome but younger as well thank you